Hello, welcome back. It's the next day. I have stayed here overnight and I have waited until the afternoon now. It's four o'clock. It is so hot here, 45 degrees. A little bit of wind right now, which is nice. A little bit of a cloud coverage or mist, whatever it is. Now I will drive to Shingiti to explore the little village. And I will take you with me, of course. So here I am in Tsingiti. It has been a very long ride. Altogether it took me a few days to come here, which is crazy. But let's see, I just walk in here and explore Tsingiti a little bit. And maybe I'll find someone who speaks English and to get some information. That would be wonderful. I have no clue where I am going. I'm just strolling around and trying to figure out where what is. And at some point I try to find the mosque. Shingiti was founded in the year 777 AD. The name Shingiti means spring of horses. By the 11th century, Shingiti had become a trading center for a confederation of Berber tribes. In 1996, UNESCO designated Shingiti as a World Heritage Site. Notable buildings in the town include the Friday Mosque of Shingiti, which is the mosque I will be going to, and ancient structures of dry stone constructions. Shingiti's Friday Mosque is widely considered by Mauritanians to be the national symbol of the country. There are only 4,800 people living here, and that includes the newer part of Shingiti. The village is seriously threatened by the encroaching desert, which I have also witnessed just outside of Shingiti. There are many houses which are half or completely buried by the sand. Some other facts in Mauritania generally which have shocked me a little bit are the fact that roughly 37% of girls are married below the age of 18 and 14% are even married before the age of 15. I have seen that multiple times over the period I have been in Mauritania that some families have a big age gap between father and mother. And I'm not talking about 10 years, I'm rather talking about 30 or more years here. The time went by quite quickly today. I have seen a little bit of Shingiti. I didn't walk through all of it as I was very quickly invited by Fatima and Abdi to sit with them, have tea. The day today was a mix of sightseeing and socializing, which was very wonderful. It was very nice. And actually tomorrow I have been invited for lunch at 1 p.m. So I will go there, eat with them, and then, I don't know, I don't have a plan yet. I think I will make a plan tomorrow. I will go straight to bed now. I haven't even eaten anything today, but that's okay, I'll skip that. See you tomorrow. Oh, look at that. It's a big boy. Big boy.
Shingiti was a very nice experience. People are super friendly, very inviting. Although at the beginning very pushy with souvenirs, going here, going there, but in the end I became friends with them and spent so much time with them and that's what I really like about traveling this way. Being open, taking the time to explore and also to open up for people. And this experience here in Shingeti was just amazing. That was so cool, especially the last night with the dancing and the music that I would not have seen if I wouldn't have stayed here for a little longer. I have said goodbye to everyone, but it didn't work without having tea. Last five kilometers, let's go. One more stop before the destination, because Look at this.
I have arrived. I have made it. But I won't be able to park here and um, to stay here for the night. I will go out two kilometers again because here, as you can see, there is still people living and I don't want to park and sleep where others are living. That's, that doesn't feel right. And on top, some um, there was a group of people, you have seen it just before, they have invited me to come into the desert, um, or in between the mountains actually, to um, have a tea with them. So that's what I will do in a minute. But first I will drink a lot of water and eat something. And after that I will go to uh, to the boys and visit them and have tea with them. So yeah, look at that how beautiful it is here. That's so amazing. They seem to grow plastic bottle trees here. That's interesting. Okay, I quickly had some food and a drink. That was wonderful. And now I will be driving towards where they told me they are and hopefully I will find them. So here we go, here they are! <laughs> My tea invitation for today. Lovely Mauritania! <laughs> Welcome! <laughs> All of the tourists! I will go now and enjoy this evening. Thank you so much for watching today's video again and see you in the next one. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
אחת.